Hello and welcome to another episode of Path of Exile Maps. I am running here with uh, Evadamin, who is my evasion uh, dagger claw build. Um, I am going to run today a 72 torture chamber map solo. So let's get to it. Here is, oh, I do have my hideout in case you were wondering, <laughs> with Haku and Elrion. I'm still, I haven't done a lo lot in standard lately, so I haven't gotten all very many of the masters yet, but who knows, maybe we'll run into one sometime. But let's head out to the Eternal Laboratory. Alright, I don't know if I've done a torture chamber map before, so we'll see. Or at least I don't remember it if, <laughs> if I did. I hope the boss isn't too bad. So. It's funny, I'm still having a little bit of an issue with mana, and so I'm wondering if I might switch over to Herald of Ash. I did it in another character, or maybe one of the other new effects, just because hatred takes up so much. Oh, I need to turn the PoE sounds down, I think. Sometimes the sounds are so loud, they, they're they even louder than the recording, so I just need to make sure you can hear me. Oh, now it's really quiet. <laughs> Too quiet. You can't hear me hitting at all. At least I can't even hear me hitting. Which can be a problem if you don't hear everything going on, like the monsters and stuff. Although I think they're a little bit more obvious in Minecraft, the monsters. You hear zombies coming up behind you. Okay, let, let's pop back and readjust. There we go. Do you guys ever find yourself having problems adjusting between characters? Um, I have been playing my uh, Rampage Tornado Shot character for a while now and I keep trying to attack like I'm a ranged character here and I'm obviously not. I'm very much of a get right in your face character here. So maybe it's good to come back and play her every every day or so. Just And to do my, my daily missions of course because that helps me gain reputation with the masters that are in my hideout. So I have nothing more to give. Probably a good idea. And plus to remind myself how to play a tank. Now I just keep standing back and wait, why isn't it attacking? Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't have a bow. I'm just wondering if if those effects like Harold of Ash, those skills are gonna take over for the auras because they take a lot less mana and they they add the damage, the extra damage for you that you want. Now, of course, I've been leveling Hatred up for a while. Hmm, what, what is it? Does it say? Now I think I have to open it up to see what level it is. So, initially it won't be as good, but you could always buy a higher level one if you wanted. This map is kind of tough, especially by myself. My life has been going up and down quite a bit. I did take advantage of the masters and crafted some new life onto one of my rings and some um, dexterity onto the other one. They were they were already pretty good and my my helmet is bringer of rain of course and yeah I'm also purity of elements. I forgot I had that. I had just put that on. Maybe I was going to run that instead of hatred. I was thinking about it, but um. Anyway, what I was saying is that my other my my boots, my gloves, and my helmet are all unique, and so they can't be crafted. So, with this character, there's not a ton I can do with the masters. At least, well, I can craft maps later, I think, but I don't have I don't have her yet. The uh, map master, I forgot what her name is. I know uh. 
Ranger Avi has it, has her in his hideout in a rampage. <laughs> so. Okay, let, let's see here. Oh, I think I was trying to level up. Yeah, because that's, that's elemental resistances. Let's see. I have it on. Oh no, I don't want it there. I'm going to put it maybe on Q. Oh, there it is on Q. Let me see. How much? Not <laughs> too much mana. I have to figure something out with that. I'm doing okay most of the time. My my elemental resistances are all capped. I already checked them. My my uh, chaos resistance, of course, is not. I think I might have had that for a specific map. Yes, when you do switch back and forth between characters, sometimes it's easy to get confused and forget which one has what. I am really enjoying Tornado Shot, though. It it, it is. The way I have it set up right now is pretty OP. It re really feels OP. Uh, it took me and Ranger Avi about two seconds to go piety in normal, and that was just awesome. Now, I know she'll be worse and cruel and merciless, but still, it was kind of neat. I have nothing more to do. Now, I'm, I'm interested to see how piety is going to be in cruel, because I got into cruel last night, and uh, hmm, I want to finish up up here before I do the stairs. Um... So I'm interested to see now that I've got my character a little bit more optimized if she's going to, if piety will be so bad or if she's going to be even worse because it's cruel after all. So we'll see how it goes. Where is the door? Ah, I got decent going on. Keep popping from place to place. Just uh, don't want it to kill me. Yeah, now you can. Now you can die. <laughs> I hate those totems. Like, wait, shouldn't these things be dead? Ah, uh, another one. Is it? Which one is? <laughs> oh, a map. That maps are good. So, yeah, summer is over for a lot of people. For us, it's kind of weird here because, you know, just we didn't have a lot of time to go in the pool this summer, although we got some. But, um, the thing is now that the, like, pools are closed, most of the pools are closed and stuff because Labor Day has passed, it's hot. <laughs> it's hardly been hot all summer. And then... It's just strange. You know, here on the East Coast, it got a little. And now it's like 90s, you know, and it hasn't been that way for most of the summer. So, the weather is just kind of freaky. Now, it would have been ideal last year we went to the beach, like the first week or so in September. And it was warm enough for us to still get in the water a little bit. But, uh... This year, and we're not going to be able to do that. We've got too much stuff going on. But, uh, it should be interesting. Let's see how the weather holds out. Last year, we had tons and tons. If you're anybody else in the U.S., you probably know this. Tons and tons and tons of snow. Like, more than we norm normally have, and up until it lasted until April. Which is just really bizarre for this particular area. And so, um... I'm interested to see, will it be worse? I mean, there's some predictions saying it's going to be awful, and, you know. But we'll see. I'm sure my kids would love lots of snow. I mean, they're homeschoolers, so they don't, like, get school off or anything. But, you know, still, they like to get outside, especially the younger ones. Oh, boy, that's a lot. <laughs> I gotta actually pay attention to what I'm fighting here. I don't want to five 
socket. I want a six socket. Oh, I'm so gonna die. Oh my gosh. This is a tough area. What's going on here? I could be having fizz reflect or something and not realizing it. Oh, there's a shrine that let me see if I can grab that. Maybe that would help me out. I remember one of the mods was more totems. I didn't think it would be a problem, but <laughs> I like that they make them made the maps bigger. It's kind of cool because there's just more. To, sometimes the maps would take like five minutes. Come here, you guys. Ribbons, ribbons everywhere. Only a game like this teach you be afraid of ribbons. Let's see, we can pick up Veil Totem, huh? <sighs> A lot of stuff going on here. It can get a little confusing when your character is so fast. <laughs> like, sometimes I'm still attacking when I'm and the monsters are all gone. Alright, how many mobs we got left on this floor? Oof. I, I don't like the two level ones because the... Uh, the remaining command doesn't mean as much. Because if there's somebody left on the other floor, no freezing, no freezing. Like, oh, there we go. I couldn't, couldn't open the door there for a second. Got to remember with this character, some of it's life leech or whatever so I really gotta or life gain on hit so I gotta keep hitting otherwise I'm dying hitting or dying not both Ugh. there we go I, th I think I was having a little bit of lag there okay is that it Well, I think it's most of them, it's not it. So I'm gonna head back over to the door. If I run into anybody on my way out, I'll take them with me. Now, no, that's where, that's where I came in, I think. Oh no, okay, that's right. That's where I need to go. Sorry, I got confused. When they show both parts, the levels on the map, it sometimes, like, did, is that an area I haven't been to? Now, of course, this is going to be the boss area, so I better be super careful. <gasps> oh my goodness, what got me? What got me? Ah, uh, okay. Good thing I hate losing XPs, but... Whoops, wasted a portal. Okay. Now I'm going to put a portal up at the stairs, just in case it happens again. <laughs> wow. What what was that attack? I I didn't recognize it. I obviously need to be careful if I see it again and run like crazy. I'm sure someone can tell me what that attack was. Oh, there's a ribbon. Ah. Uh, it's like you are dead. You know, there are some, uh... Ranger Avi is really good at telling me which maps to do and which not, because he's like, no, that boss is a pain. So, we'll see. Okay. Let's see, whoever it is... Yeah, shock and horror. Let's go ahead and just get right on top of him. Kill him. Oh, no. Oh, oh, what is that? Ah! 
Did I put up the waypoint? I don't think I did. Ah, uh, or the portal. I'm wondering if it's worth losing it, all my XP over. I guess we're gonna find out. Did I see something there? Oh, just a totem. Take what I can get, you know? Oh, what got me? Somebody, uh, somebody got the bleeding on me. But I took care of it. It's, I have a bleeding flask there. Which really helps, but that other thing, I don't, don't really have much defense against that. I, I guess, you know, I'm, it's, I'm not up that much. I'm gonna go ahead and take it. Try it again, and if I run out of portals, that's how it goes, right? Oh yeah, okay, that is obviously... My goodness, what is that? I'm gonna have to ask about it and find out what it was. And maybe I can put in an overlay here whenever when I put this video up <laughs> and tell you what it was that killed me and how- why am I back here? Am I out of- what is I out of portals? Or I, I didn't say checkpoint, that's why. Okay. No. Yeah, back here. Okay, I got two more portals left. Put up my aura. Hope for the best. I think I'm gonna die. No, no. Ah, oh, okay. I did it again. Here. The last time, or the one time I was able to get up on top of it. Oh, shock and horror. Okay, I'm gonna be right back. Okay, I found out a little bit that has a lightning beam that shock and horror is, so we need to try to hide behind a beam, I guess, and I, I don't think it's gonna happen, but I'm gonna try my best and we'll see, and maybe next I'll re be more careful. Okay, so I need to hide behind this beam. Oh, I don't even know if I can... Ah! Oh, she got over here. I must have got her moved. She was right... Where is she? She's right there. Ah! She's such a hard boss. Okay. Well, I guess today was a loss. Um, I'm gonna... We'll try that... You know, we'll try another map later. Um, I think I'm gonna head back to my hideout. So, the lesson here, boys and girls, is... Do your research. <laughs> Which is exactly what I did not do. And now I've lost all my XP's. Ah! But it was okay. I took the choice. I could, I could have stopped after the first kill. But I, I want to see how it goes. And um, and I also don't know if that, that how that boss has changed from patch to patch. But that's a really tough boss. I think next time I'll definitely do it in a party. Or when I'm up a little bit more, although that lightning beam was just tough. I mean, that's like, bye-bye life. So, <laughs> all right. Well, that is it for today, boys and girls, <laughs> and men and women, and whoever is watching. Um, so we'll see you next time. Thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.